A new bill in Wisconsin would make it easier for law enforcement to contact you if a loved one is hurt or killed. WEAU's Eleanor Bland shares how a tragedy inspired a Wisconsin native to introduce the idea here. In 2005, Christine Olson, a Milwaukee native who now lives in Florida, lost her daughter Tiffany in a motorcycle accident. She wasn't notified about the crash for six and a half hours. The accident literally took place about 15 minutes from my home. I got the first phone call about 11.15, get to the emergency room. They said, well, she's not here. And I said, my daughter is hurt somewhere. Please help me find her. And they said, well, we don't know what to tell you. We don't know where she is. It wasn't until 1.30 a.m. that she found out her daughter had died. The incident inspired Olson to start a petition to add emergency contact information onto driver's license, which then led to the creation of TIF, or to inform families first. Right now, there are 15 states with the legislation. That means when someone scans the license in those states, the emergency person's address and phone number will show up. Olson's bill has now reached her home state of Wisconsin. 18 years it has taken Wisconsin to get on board, but I am grateful that they are finally on board. But how many people are going through what I went through that night simply because their state is not on board? Senator Jesse James co-wrote Bill SB 35 with Representative Lauren Oldenburg. Senator James says that serving in law enforcement and seeing it firsthand is what got him involved. I do have my own uh, uh, personal satisfaction in, in getting this done. Um, I think this will be a valuable tool if we have emergency contact available to us, then we can make contact with the, the family in a more responsive time in case something bad were to happen. At least the individuals, the families and loved ones would be made aware. Currently, the bill is on its way to the governor's desk for signing. If the bill gets signed, Wisconsinites will be able to renew their license and add an emergency contact that will be tied to your ID. Eleanor Bland, WEAU 13 News.